Well, I tell you what, guys, we could probably do a cold start on my avalanche. I should get it out actually and look it over and stuff, but uh, I guess we could do that. Why not? And uh, go well, from there. I see uh, Parker just went live on on uh, Twitch. I've been kind of watching him. He's been playing GTA and stuff. It's kind of fun. I should get uh, my PS2 down there, go on there. But uh, right now, I do not feel like playing it. So I'll show you. Uh, my mom got me, this thing's not very powerful to run a diesel, but I got another one, this one here. But, uh, you know, every little bit of amperage helps. So uh, let's see, it's charged. I'm gonna actually plug it in, make sure it's fully charged though. So we're gonna try that and hook her up. Yeah, you no, know, I, I mean, 700 amps peak and instant start 350 is not very much for a diesel but I mean it's got two batteries already in it so we'll try and see if it works if not I mean it was worth a try so um, this thing is pretty cool it's got a um, I gotta get it out here it's got a thing for your USB to charge your uh, phone and then it's got the uh, whatever you call it for the Oh, I can't think of it. Your cigarette lighter, whatever you put your thing to charge it in the phone or the car. And then it's got the, yeah, you click the USB to turn it on or whatever. Um, click this to turn it on. It's got an air compressor thing in the back. You charge it right here. And some information, I, know, I can't really see it, but there's on switch there. There's the, what you call it, the, oh, I don't know, air compressor thing. So, yeah, it's a Stanley. Here it is. The Stanley 700 amp, um, Stanley Fat Max. Never heard of it. But it says it only starts, uh, uh, let's see, what's it? 4, 6, and V8 engine. So, that's not really technically diesel. So, yeah, I know. Uh, but we'll just try it and we'll. Go from there and see what it works. All right, let's go outside a little bit. Still snowing. Miserable weather. Uh. the video on this for quite a while. Uh, I haven't checked the transfer case for a long time either. I don't know if the camera will be able to pick it up. Oh, she's been leaking. See it? Yep. Or no. No, no, no. That's the bobcat. Never mind, guys. Let's see. Uh, oh, maybe. I can't really tell. Yeah, it's it's been leaking, but like I said, I'm not getting rid of it until she blows. If that chancellor case blows up, she blows up. I don't really care. The battery's good. It's, yeah, it's kind of a cold start. It's not really a cold start, but I'm gonna try it here. There's a lot. Looks like it. Like I said, it's not really a cold start. But... Now, that oil leak was my bobcat, I forgot. I had my bobcat sitting right there, and you can see the tire tracks a little bit right there. I don't even know if it'll start, to be honest. Yeah, that transfer case is leaking. Two hundred fourteen thousand seven hundred sixty-eight miles. Look at that battery. How she's charging. So you show back up here, and so we don't get smoked out here. I'll back it out a little bit so I can see the transfer case. We'll put about right there. I don't know 
all that. Yeah. Bobcat guys right there. I'm sure that thing leaked a ton of oil in there. So could have had a cold start on that too, but I don't know I don't want to mess with it too much. Yeah, that transfer case will have to be serviced pretty soon, I think. I make sure she started. That's part of the reason why I don't drive her either because that transfer case is pretty bad. She's shot. She's seen better days, that's for sure. There she is. Yeah, she don't like to start out in this weather, that's for sure. Wisconsin four-cylinder engine. <laughs> like my buffer. I think that's pretty good. It works, right? Yeah, see. There, she's leaking again. That's the reason why I have it back here, because it was leaking down in the house, and I didn't want that stuff in my house, so that's why I put it back here. The tires. Not very good. It's bad. Kind of see it. Hoses aren't the best. I mean, I had to put new hoses over there. Yeah, I could have started it, but I don't know. Well, I guess I could. I just couldn't run it too long here, but it probably wear the battery down. That's the thing I worry about. You start it for no reason, and when you want to use it for. Uh, so we're removing the snow and that won't start. Yeah, let's see if we find here. Why not? Put the throttle up a little bit. Let's see where's the choke at? Oh, there it is. But yeah, you can see she's a, she's a little cold-blooded, I think. She's cold-blooded. She do not like the cold. We'll just back her back up again, I think. I'm gonna choke her now. Battery's dying already. Yeah, she's shot.
that's good enough. She does not like the cold like I don't either. Ah, it's cold out here. That's all I know. She's like me. She hates cold. Well, I think this thing's gonna be a problem starting when I'm gonna need it. So I tell you what, that jump pack will come in handy. Thank you, Mom. Something's making noise back there. Phew, it smells rich. Well, there you go, guys. At least you got to get some cold starts and until I get to the farm anyway. I don't know if I can, because I'll show you here. Um, Look at the snow coming down. Look at that. The roads are just snow covered and iced and it's kind of pretty in a way. Um, yeah, I'm gonna warm my hands up a little bit. Oh yeah, a little too hot. <laughs> uh, but uh, yeah, uh, that, so. did I miss my seat? A little bit. Oh, guys. Yeah. You probably noticed that the thing is a little annoying. Well, I got a new lens. Because the old lens quit working. And uh, this one, uh, well, they claim it, okay, it's supposed to focus better. And uh, I know, I knew it was going to be noisy. I have the shotgun mic on her. But uh, I still hear it, so I hope you guys are not upset. But here it is, it zooms in a little faster, a little, only a little farther. It's uh, 17 by 85 USM ultrasonic whatever lens. And God, this thing's heavy. Here, I'll show you. Look at that thing. Oh my God, that lens is big. It looks like a big, huge eye about this big. Yeah, didn't pay much for the lens, so um, hopefully the YouTube videos will turn out much better. I don't know about the sound, about the focusing, because it's always going, er, 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 er. it is vibrating the camera as I hold it. So anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that little cold start on a couple of things. i glad my mom gave me this, because it will come in handy, because I don't think that bobcat's going to want to start out there, so... We got this thing here, so thank you, Mom, as always. And uh, she watches my YouTube videos and so on, and all my family does and whatever. So um, it's just always been my dream to do YouTube. I mean, I love cameras and I love computers, so I mean, there you go. All right, guys, well, thanks for watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe, and follow me on Twitter. And uh, hopefully, get to the farm after this weather clears up, and you can see how miserable it is. So. Right now, I gotta go help my family now because the one that got kept getting sick, he's better today. So I gotta go to work. All right, until next time, I hopefully get that Ford started. I won't. We'll see. I kind of am curious now. Talk to you guys later.